My first decent guitar was a Fender Strat. And I routed out the pickup, put a humbucker in there because that's what everyone else is doing right at the bridge position. After getting bored with that, I moved on to a Gibson Flying V, which I still have. And then I realized I needed a second backup guitar. So I bought a Kramer, and this is when uh, um, Floyd Roses had just come out. I go to a rehearsal, you know, Exodus, start playing, go, go for the whammy bars, you know, start doing this, and pop! And I go, dang, okay, what, what, what was that pack of strings? And I read it, and I go, okay, I'm not going to use those. Go to the store, buy a different pack of strings, play, at rehearsal, use a whammy bar, pop! <laughs> Look at the pack of strings, okay, I'm not going to use those. Third pack, you know. Third try, go to rehearsal, whammy bar. All right, it's all right. You know, check my tuning. It's staying in tune. End of rehearsal. I didn't break any strings. What was the, what was the name of that? The, those those strings? Ernie Ball Super Slinky. Okay, Ernie Ball Super Slinky. These are the ones we need. I was 18 years old. I started using Ernie Ball Super Slinkies because they didn't break. <laughs>